On to a major project for the city of Savannah, and it's in the books. And while it's not something you'll notice right away, if you live downtown, you'll definitely reap the rewards. So we're uh, on our way to wrapping up the Bilbo Canal uh, drainage improvement project. It's a $23 million project. Nearly two thirds of the funding came through the Special Purpose Local Option Sales Tax, or SPLOST. It's also a project to help alleviate flooding for more than 1,200 acres. So all that historic downtown area, uh, densely populated, highly developed downtown portion of Savannah, and all that water that runs off the streets uh, is coming, making its way this way and going to go out this canal to the Savannah River. The Bilbo Canal is 90 feet wide with seven floodgates at the north end. So you can really see the, the scale of the infrastructure, I think, when you get under here. You can see each of the individual uh, seven foot by 11 foot wide tide gates. At low tide, groundwater, whatever's coming to the canal is going to go out into the river, every low tide. Then when that tide starts to rise above elevation negative two, uh, the, the gates will shut, they'll seal tight, the tide will continue to rise. The tide's gonna rise on up to about elevation four, four and a half. And that kind of puts it into perspective how this system works. It's all the hydrostatic pressure of, uh, you know, what, what water elevation's higher, the canal elevation or the river elevation. And that determines when the gates will crack open have that differential enough to crack the gates open and let that water start flowing out. What we have in other situations, other basins, is our, our pump stations. And, and they can move a lot of water, but those stations require electricity, uh, a lot of, uh, consume a lot of power to run those pumps, and also there's a lot of maintenance associated with those. Um, so this system is gonna, gonna just, just work day, day after day uh, in a very uh, limited amount of uh, input from the city's operations and maintenance. The Bilbo Canal project was also key to putting back Foundry Street, which runs through the Eastern Wharf, a major project extending the full downtown Riverwalk.